the journey of a little shoot in the great Franciscan tree. Bartinoro, the cradle of our institute. It was 123 years ago on May 1st, 1898 at Bartinoro in Italy that the Institute of the Clarist Franciscan Missionaries of the Most Blessed Sacrament was born as a tiny shoot from the great Franciscan tree. The name chosen by the founders, Venerable Mother Serafina Farolfi, for her institute is not just for chance, but indicates a program of life. Venerable Mother Serafina Farolfi, a visionary with a mission. Since the age of reason, I felt a call to active religious life, precisely to a missionary one. There was never anyone quite like me. I am the only me that you will ever see. God had CFMSs in mind when he planned to create a great missionary in the person of Serafina. Tosignano, a little town nestling in the shadow of the Apennine Range in Italy, is a pleasant cluster of villas, orchards, vineyards, and cornfields. On October 7, 1853, a baby was born to Frederick and Othelia Sant'Angelo at Tosignano in Italy. She was baptized and lovingly called Francisca. While studying in the school and diploma in teacher training, young Francisca felt the call of God. In 1873, she left her home and consecrated her life to Jesus. And on 1st May 1898, a new shoot began in the form of CFMSs with the motto, I carry the mysteries. Drawing from the spirituality of St. Francis and St. Clair of Assisi, Mother Serafina laid deep foundation for a spirituality of contemplation and action centered on the Eucharistic Jesus, who was for her light and guide, strength and stronghold. Mother Serafina was an educationist. Back in 1898, when she saw that the girls are deprived of education, she began educational institutions for girls. But responding to the signs of the times, she began co-ed institutions and involved the sisters in many more apostolic activities. They are pastoral, social, medical, care for the less privileged, care for the senior citizens and in many other ways we involve ourselves for the upliftment of the poor, needy and the women. Sacred Heart Senior Secondary School is one of those institutions which cater to the education of the girls and we strive to take our girls to the society as responsible citizens and good human beings. We exist in 12 countries and in almost all the states in India and we render our services as Eucharistic missionaries. Eucharistic missionary ardor inflamed her prayer thought, word, and action. As Franciscans, they are to be actively engaged in spreading the good news through their daily activities, whether tending to the sick and looking after the abandoned and the destitute, 
or educating the youth. Though education of the youth, especially the destitute and the abandoned in forsaken places, was the main aim of Mother Serafina, the Glaze field of activities took wider range within a short period. The request to open new convents came from cardinals and bishops who had stood by her in the turbulent times. She got ready a group of four young sisters who set sail in 1901. In India, CFMSS established many educational institutions. Sacred Heart Chandigarh is one of them. It was established in the year 1968. Here we have the teachers who have long association with the institution sharing their experiences. It is rightly said that each and every part of your life is a great learning experience and what better learning experience than three decades spent in molding the young bright minds. It is this school which defines me who I am today and will remain etched in my memory for years to come. I am indeed proud to be a part of this institution and pray to the Almighty that may this school continue to soar higher and higher and reach the pinnacles of glory. My association with Sacred Heart and with the Franciscan sisters goes back to over 30 years. In 1987, when I began my eventful journey, I had no idea that this bond would become so meaningful, so strong, so eventful. Being of service to humanity in a humble way and walking on the path illuminated by Mother Serafina has given meaning to my life. I have found a second home here and I am grateful to God for guiding me to the portals of Sacred Heart. On April 1st, 1991, I stepped into one of the most prestigious institutions, the Sacred Heart, as a young girl bubbling with enthusiasm and excitement. It's been three decades since that day I find myself to have gained in term of experience as I saw the institution grow and evolved into one of the premier institution of the country. While the institution evolved and developed world-class infrastructure and facilities, its core value system protected and implemented by the sisters remain its biggest asset. To grow as an agent of change and social transformation by molding our young generation to be conscious, caring, spiritually rooted, emotionally balanced, intellectually competent and responsible citizens imbued with noble values and concern for the less fortunate is a vision of Sacred Heart Senior Secondary School as guided by Seraphinian way of education. It is my proud privilege and honor to work as a teacher in Sacred Heart Senior Secondary School, Chandigarh. We can give children only two things in life strong roots and powerful wings, then they may fly anywhere and live independently. For me, teaching transcends importance of knowledge which includes bonding and forming affinity with students who are in my class. God bless you all. Every person in our Sacred Heart family is important. Helping hands are our blessings. Mermes. मैं सेकंड आर्ट में 1985 से आया शिष्य लोगों के साथ हम लोगों ने काम किया उसके बाद शिष्य लोग हमारा मदद करते हैं सभी हेल्प करते हैं कोई प्रॉब्लम होता है तो मेडिकल या उसमें भी तो हमारा सहयोग देते हैं उसके लिए हम इनके तहे दिल से शुक्रिया अदा करते हैं आज का दिन है बहुत ही लुभावना इस दिन ने हम सबका मन हर्षाया मदर सेरेपिना के स्वप्न को हम सबने साकार किया 
शिक्षा में ही नहीं खेल व दूसरे क्षेत्रों में भी हमारे विद्यालय ने बहुत नाम कमाया आज के पावन अवसर पर सेक्रेट हार्ट विद्यालय इस संस्था से जुड़े परिवार के हर सदस्य को दिल से करता है नमन यूं ही खिलता रहे हमारी उम्मीदों का चमन